In 1990, the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air burst onto our screens, bringing laughter and life lessons to millions. Now, 34 years later, we take a poignant look back at the beloved cast members who have tragically left us too soon. From the Banks family to the show's memorable guest stars, these talented actors brought warmth, humor, and depth to their roles, creating characters that would become cultural icons and leaving an indelible mark on television history. Number 15, Kim Fields, who guest starred on The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air as Will's girlfriend Monique in 1993, has continued to thrive in the entertainment industry. Since her appearance on the show, Fields has maintained a successful career both in front of and behind the camera. She's taken on roles in various TV series, including Living Single and The Real Housewives of Atlanta. In recent years, Fields has expanded her repertoire, venturing into directing and producing. As of 2024, at 54 years old, she remains active in the industry, showcasing her versatility and enduring talent across multiple facets of television and film production. Number 14. John Amos, who played Fred Wilkes, Lisa's father, in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, continued to be a respected figure in Hollywood long after his appearance on the show. Known for his powerful performances, Amos went on to feature in numerous TV series and films, including recurring roles in The West Wing and Men in Trees. His career spanned over five decades, showcasing his versatility as an actor. Tragically, John Amos passed away on December 21, 2023, at the age of 83. His death was announced by his daughter, Shannon Amos, who stated he died of natural causes. Amos left behind a legacy of groundbreaking roles and performances that continue to inspire actors today. Number 13, Will Smith, the titular Fresh Prince, has undergone a remarkable transformation since his breakout role in the 1990s sitcom. From a charismatic young actor, Smith has evolved into one of Hollywood's most bankable stars. His career post-Fresh Prince includes blockbuster hits like Independence Day, Men in Black, and Ollie, showcasing his versatility in both action and dramatic roles. Smith has also ventured into producing and has won numerous awards, including an Academy Award for his role in King Richard. As of 2024, at 55 years old, Smith continues to be a prominent figure in the entertainment industry, balancing his acting career with various business ventures and philanthropic efforts. Number 12, Tisha Campbell, who guest starred as Will's girlfriend Kathleen in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has maintained a vibrant career in the entertainment industry since her appearance on the show. Best known for her role as Gina in the long-running sitcom Martin, Campbell has continued to showcase her talents in both television and film. She's had recurring roles in popular series like My Wife and Kids and Empire, demonstrating her versatility as an actress. As of 2024, at 55 years old, Campbell remains active in Hollywood, not only as an actress, but also as a singer and producer. She's also become an advocate for autism awareness, inspired by her son's diagnosis. Number 11, James Avery, beloved for his role as Uncle Phil in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, left an indelible mark on television history. After the show ended, Avery continued to work steadily in both TV and film, showcasing his versatility in drama and comedy. 
He lent his distinctive voice to animated series and appeared in shows like That 70s Show and The Closer. Tragically, Avery passed away on December 31, 2013, at the age of 68, due to complications from open-heart surgery. His death was deeply felt by fans and colleagues alike, with Will Smith describing him as a second father. Avery's portrayal of Uncle Phil remains iconic, remembered for its blend of authority, wisdom, and heart. Number 10. Tyra Banks, who guest starred as Jackie Ames in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has transformed from a young actress and model into a multifaceted entertainment mogul. Since her appearance on the show, Banks has become a household name, dominating both the modeling and television industries. She created and hosted the long-running reality TV series America's Next Top Model, which became a global phenomenon. Banks also hosted her own talk show and served as the host of America's Got Talent. As of 2024, at 50 years old, she continues to be a powerful force in the entertainment world, expanding her empire into business ventures, writing, and producing, while also being an advocate for body positivity and women's empowerment. Number 9. Nia Long, who played Lisa Wilkes, Will's girlfriend and later fiancé in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has continued to shine in Hollywood since her memorable role on the show. Long's career has flourished with a mix of television and film roles, showcasing her versatility as an actress. She starred in popular movies like Boys in the Hood, Soul Food, and The Best Man franchise, cementing her status as a leading lady in African-American cinema. On television, Long has had recurring roles in series such as Third Watch and Empire. As of 2024, at 53 years old, she remains a respected figure in the entertainment industry, known for her talent, grace, and advocacy for diversity in Hollywood. Number 8. Alfonso Ribeiro, who portrayed the iconic Carlton Banks in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has maintained a steady presence in the entertainment industry since the show's conclusion. His character's signature Carlton dance became a pop culture phenomenon that continues to resonate today. Post-Fresh Prince, Ribeiro has diversified his career, venturing into hosting and reality TV. He won season 19 of Dancing with the Stars in 2014, showcasing his enduring dance skills. Since 2015, Ribeiro has been the host of America's Funniest Home Videos, taking over from Tom Bergeron. As of 2024, at 52 years old, he continues to be a beloved figure in American television, known for his charisma, humor, and versatility as both an actor and host. Number 7. Virginia Capers, who appeared as Hattie Banks, Philip Banks' mother, in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, was a veteran actress with a career spanning several decades. Known for her powerful presence and versatility, Capers had already made a name for herself on Broadway, winning a Tony Award for her role in the musical Raisin in 1974. Her appearances on Fresh Prince added to her extensive list of television credits. Sadly, Virginia Capers passed away on May 6, 2004, at the age of 78, due to pneumonia. Her legacy in the entertainment industry includes numerous stage, film, and television performances, showcasing her talent across multiple mediums. Capers is remembered for her contributions to African-American representation in the arts and her memorable portrayals of strong, matriarchal figures.
Number 6. Jennifer Lewis, who guest starred as Will's Aunt Helen in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has continued to be a dynamic force in the entertainment industry. Known as the mother of black Hollywood, Lewis has built an impressive career spanning theater, film, and television. Since her appearance on Fresh Prince, she has taken on numerous memorable roles, including a long-running part as Ruby Johnson on the hit series Blackish. Lewis has also lent her distinctive voice to various animated projects. As of 2024, at 67 years old, she remains active in the industry, continually showcasing her powerful vocals and commanding screen presence. Beyond acting, Lewis is known for her advocacy work, particularly in mental health awareness, openly sharing her own experiences with bipolar disorder. Number 5. Verne Watson, who played Viola Vi Smith, Will's mother, in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has maintained a steady and successful career in television since her memorable role on the show. With a career spanning over four decades, Watson has become a familiar face on both daytime and primetime television. Post Fresh Prince, she has appeared in numerous popular series, including recurring roles in The Big Bang Theory and General Hospital, for which she won two Daytime Emmy Awards. As of 2024, at 74 years old, Watson continues to be active in the industry, showcasing her versatility and talent. Her longevity in Hollywood is a testament to her skill and adaptability as an actress, continuing to take on diverse roles across various genres. Number 4. Janet Hubert, best known for her role as the original Aunt Vivian in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has had a complex journey in the entertainment industry since leaving the show after its third season. Her departure was surrounded by controversy, leading to a long-standing feud with Will Smith that was only recently resolved. Despite the challenges, Hubert continued her acting career, appearing in various TV shows and films. She had roles in series like Gilmore Girls, One Life to Live, and more recently, The Last OG. In 2020, Hubert participated in the Fresh Prince reunion special, where she and Smith publicly reconciled. As of 2024, at 68 years old, Hubert remains active in the industry, showcasing her resilience and talent. Her story has become a testament to personal growth and the power of reconciliation in Hollywood. Number 3. Johari Johnson, who played an ancillary role in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has experienced significant changes since her time on the show. In 1990, she was known for her vibrant energy and compelling performances. Over the years, Johari has continued to work in the entertainment industry, expanding her portfolio to include various roles in television and film. Tragically, Johari Johnson passed away in 2021. Her death was a great loss to her fans and the entertainment community, as she was remembered not only for her talent, but also for her warm and generous spirit. Number 2 Michael Weiner, who played an occasional role in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has undergone notable changes since his time on the show. In 1990, he was known for his dynamic presence and memorable appearances. Over the years, Michael Weiner diversified his career, engaging in various aspects of the entertainment industry, including acting, directing, and producing. Sadly, Michael Weiner passed away in 2023. His passing was a profound loss, leaving behind a legacy of creativity and passion that inspired many in the industry. Number 3. 
Number 1. Charlie Earl Woodard, who played a recurring role in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, has seen significant changes since her time on the show. In 1990, she was celebrated for her captivating performances and strong screen presence. Over the years, Charlie Earl continued to make her mark in the entertainment industry, taking on diverse roles in both television and film. Unfortunately, Charlie Earl Woodard passed away in 2019. Her death was deeply felt by fans and colleagues alike as she left behind a legacy of talent and dedication that continues to inspire many. As we remember the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air cast members who are no longer with us, we're reminded of the joy and inspiration they brought to our lives. Their performances continue to resonate with audiences old and new, a testament to their enduring talent and the show's timeless appeal. While we mourn their loss, we celebrate the laughter they shared, the barriers they broke, and the legacy they left behind. The Banks Mansion may be a fictional place, but the impact of these remarkable actors will forever live on in our hearts and in pop culture. <laughs>